it's not often I do this, you know, I've recorded the video, my impressions as I play through as always, but I've supported this game for two years, it's in very early access, I've understood this, but this version is just a huge, huge step back from the last version. I've been waiting six months for this to come out, I've been excited. He's been saying, the developer's been like, oh yeah, it's coming soon, and it hasn't come soon, there's been very little updates, and yeah, he's put a new map in. But it just seems to have ruined it. It doesn't work. It wouldn't start or spawn any missions by the looks of it. I mean, I don't know if I just had to keep waiting, but last time I didn't, it would spawn missions quite regularly. There didn't seem to be a way for you to spawn your own missions or kick one off, which is lacking. I don't know why he's taken that privilege away from us. The car customization seemed a lot worse. And there was no copy option either from what I could see. Because, as you'll see at the end of this video, I've put in what it used to look like, and you could save your model and then just copy, 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 copy. So you could set one up you really liked and just keep using it, but that doesn't seem to be there either. So I'm not sure what he's done with this game or why. I know he's saying six weeks to the next one. Yeah, I'll pop back in six weeks and give it a go and see if he's actually done anything. But this is super, super disappointing. And the video is just basically me giving it a go, logging in, playing around been mainly very disappointed and angry as I go through frustration with crashes and that sort of thing and then at the end I've included a bit of video of what it used to look like six months ago which I think it worked a lot better so anyway I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll catch you all later goodbye hello and welcome to the 15 minute gamer channel my name is Tony and this is keep the peace version 0.26 I've been waiting for this for bloody ages it must be March since the last one, March, April, it's been a very long time. But as you can see, we have a overhaul of the game's code, most of its features, plus new content, including the brand new map, new user interface, new mission patrol system, and the rest is coming in the next one. So, <clears throat> without further ado, let's crack on with it. Right, so this is the new map. Obviously, we're going to pause it straight away, just while we have a little bit of a look around. As you can see, this map is huge compared to the old one. Well, is it? It's not huge compared to the old one, but it's definitely a lot bigger. And a lot more varied as well. You can see you've got some sort of shopping district. You've got uh, farmland up here. You've got high-rise flats over there. <clears throat> I guess this is the police station, maybe? Yeah, possibly. Um, for some reason, that road seems to be a little textured. And for those who don't know, I've played this game for owned it since the start to be fair so yeah i was looking forward to showing it off to you guys so what we've got there officer um, available let's hire everyone <clears throat> um does it let me hire on mass no we'll just do that then that is fine we'll get everyone hired we can see that there's all the hired personnel let's set up the cars my favorite bit let's see if they've improved any of these so we've got create new unit okay we've got a new vehicle type good so we've got this kind of station wagon type thing so i think we'll call this alpha bravo 221 to start off with um and then we've got the vehicle there right so this is all new as well so we've got variation plane what else can we have in here so we've got variation name we'll call it plane we'll have it unmarked Body, it's called unmarked anyway. Call sign, show side decals. Oh, it's on there. Okay, that's fine. And top. We'll get rid of side and just show top, I think, in black. And then you've got the light bars uh, down here. I don't know how these work now. There's a click and drag. These used to be clickable. But I wonder if it's because... Oh, no, because you'd have lights in the unmarked car, wouldn't you? Oh, there we go. Okay, so we've got a light bar at the back. These look kind of unmarky. So we can... Sh oh, we can put them in there. Okay, so it looks like we can put that in the front. It's a bit clunky, this system-like. Um, we'll go for double there. Double there. Did they go in? I don't know. I'm not too sure. I don't know if I like this new system. There and there. I still can't tell if they went... In there. Right, that's definitely in there then. So could we have... Oh, right, okay. So you got to click on the little things. So we've got lights up there. We've got single lights, which I guess can go on the mirrors. Yep, okay, good. So we'll put that on the mirror. 
And we'll put that on the mirror. And I think that's enough light for me on the cover car. So I'm going to click confirm. Um, we've got no special equipment. Personnel, we'll just put you and you. Head and Sims, you're in there. And confirm. Good. We will have create new unit. We'll have a B22, which is fine. Vehicle, let's go for this. We can have painted. So we'll have police. We can have customized. So if we want to change it around, we've got top call sign. We've got the light bar on top. So we've already got that there. We could put some more lights in it though, because I like light, lots of lights in my car. Plus, apparently, they have redone the lighting models. So obviously, the more lights, the better. And then, should we have a big light bar on the back? Yep, good. And then two small light bars at the top. This thing is going to be very bright. So we'll click. Um, yeah, that looks good to me. Good, good, good. And confirm. Now, can we copy this? You used to be able to copy. I don't know if you can now. It'd be 23. We'll go for this one. We'll go for there. Uh, we'll stick it. It's a nice little color. So we'll just confirm there. Create new unit. It'd be 24. We'll have we'll cut that one's only plain. We'll have another one of them. Click confirm. And we'll have one more for good luck, I think. We'll have another plain one of these. Confirm. Not as many lights because it doesn't seem to let you pick them, which is a bit annoying. So I have A, B, 25, 24, 23, 21. I was hoping you could click on there and maybe thingy. So we're going to close that. Press play. I'm not hearing any noise yet. Right, we've got new mission at the top. No idea what that done. Seems to possibly crash the game though. So maybe that was a bad thing. <laughs> oh no, I've crashed the game already. God damn it. Oh, right. I'm going to be back in a minute. I'm going to get this all set back up again. Ooh, have you unfrozen? Nope. Okay. Right, we are back. <laughs> Don't press that new mission button. So here's my unit here. A little nicely parked up. Which is nice. The models definitely do look a little bit better. We're going to press play. Right, so um, I think that new mission button must be patrols. So can we send you out and about now or what? Hmm, that definitely changed this. I'm worried I'm not going to get a mission until I do some, like click that button. But if I click that button, I'm going to lose everything yet again. The models definitely look better. I think it might pop filters really annoying lately. I don't know what's wrong with it. It's like, I'm just going to pop and fall off. Right, Um, we have lots more personnel, so we could do some more vehicles. Can I run this to do something? See, we used to have a menu where you could spawn missions and stuff. I still think it's that button, but it seemed to crash the game last time. So I'm a bit dubious about pressing it. <laughs> Can you drive out? I think that's what we've got to do. That I really think we need to press this button. Let's try it again. Oh, there we go. Oh, it worked that time. Right, so let's set patrol areas up. So I want a patrol area all up here and up there and up there and up there. And there. We're going to confirm new area. Yep. So do we just click and drag you to sign, you just put, and then right click. As I've got someone on that one, good, 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 good. He's going to go off on his little patrol. Sweet, let's try new mission number two. It has crashed again, so we've lost the game. <sighs> right, attempt number four. Actually, you missed an attempt where I was trying to create a unit and hadn't employed anyone. I'll try to then go back and employ people, and it broke again. So, I put a unit called just Tit. Um, immature, some might say, but <laughs> I'm getting sick of it now. And I just work, man. Jesus Christ. Um, so, what I'm going to do is just leave the game running at super fast speed, and we'll see if anything happens. I'm just going to kick back, not do anything. 
Um, how are you been? Is is everyone well? Um, it's all small talk I've got. So yeah, let's talk about this game then. Uh, he's ruined it. The map, yeah. New UI doesn't work. It, the old UI worked way better. Um, there doesn't seem to be a way to now spawn jobs in or take it as a game where you could put a bit more control in. I mean, nothing's happening. There's no calls coming up. There's no incidents coming up. There's no anything. And I can't click new mission because it'll crash the game. Give it a try again. Look at Echo there. Even Echo's paying attention. I didn't even say Echo in there. Okay, thanks. Bloody Echo. See? And then it crashes again. So you know what? I'm giving up. Um, I'm getting sick of early access games. Absolutely sick of them. <sighs> Dead Matter basically broke my back. This is now pushing me over the edge. I can't deal with it. It's crap. What I'm going to do, if I can, is just put in some old footage here and just show you how it should work. And you'll see the difference of how easy it was to control, how it all worked, that sort of thing. But anyway, I'll catch you all later. Goodbye. And a lot of developments go on. So we're straight away going to pause it, of course. Unit management, U unit. Uh, we're just going to select a vehicle. We'll have standard patrol car. Confirm. Um, and we will have good old black and white, I think. Uh, we've got two officer seats in there, but we haven't got any officers. So first off, let's just employ all, like we always do. Um, hire all. Yep. Um. Oh, dear God. <laughs> oh, this is... Yeah, so pistol, nightstick. Um, cause I wonder if that is gonna screw up. Yep, that'll do. Okay, that's fine. Right, um, so we just want two guys in here, confirm, um, light in, we just want a light bar, I think we're just going to go for a modern light bar there, or modern light bar stealth or traditional, no we're just going to go modern I think, yeah, um, put in some blue and red lights in there, Put some blue and red in there, and I think. A couple of blueies in there. Sweet. Um, exterior equipment. We can put a push bar on. We always do that. I think that's, yeah, still the only one. Uh, want some prisoner seats in. Yep, trunk equipment. Still nothing in there. So we're going to save that design. Number one. And we're going to call it number one. That'll, that'll, that'll confuse it. And we're going to call this 101. And then we're going to go confirm new unit. And then we're going to go new unit. We're going to copy last. We're going to call this 102. Uh, we're going to put another two officers in. Confirm. We're going to have copy last 103. Two of them will confirm new unit. <clears throat> we'll have some I think we'll have some SUVs in this one so we're just going to have oh Canada for no reason whatsoever <laughs> Canadian police cars uh, light in again we'll put on some stealth light bars we'll put on blue and red blue and blue and at the back here we'll have uh, wide blue and wide red exterior push bars of course uh, material equipment some prisoner seats so we can always transport uh, you and you 
confirm and we're going to have 104. New unit, copy last. Um, and we'll have three of these. <coughs> Oops. 105. Sorry if I cough and stuff like that. Uh, I have coronavirus by the looks of it. Um, I've been self isolating for a week and had to contact. Uh, 101 the non-emergency 111 the non-emergency health line number because I couldn't breathe properly last night so yeah I'm not feeling amazing let's put it that way um, and we'll just copy last and we've got four of them that's seven cars I think seven cars should be able to and then we're going to press play and all these guys will report G. It's been quite a few changes on here, uh, especially with uh, incident management. And I think the map looks a little bit better now as well. It's had a bit of a change, I think. So let's see what that brings. Um, of course, now I've got to remember all the buttons. Q and E. We could get some patrol routes set up. So we're going to have... We'll have this downtown district here as patrol zone 1. Uh, we'll have patrol zone 2 can be all the way up here, down here, like that. We'll have uh, number 3, which can be everything else that's kind of left. <laughs> Don't know road goes. Oh, we have an instant. Hands. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hang on a second. Confirm. Right, what we got? We got a shoplifter. Right, let's send. I think. Let's send 104 and 101. Just in case. I don't think it's going to be a bad one. But we kind of need the units on scene. possibly got a yeah they're gonna go and get the suspect and these guys should be speaking to him yep good evidence secured and then they're just gonna go and get the pair put in the car and we can continue on our little day right uh patrols you go on patrol one you go on patrol two you go on patrol three. Um, can I have you two units and a shoplifting? Unit one hundred four doesn't have any orders for this one. Um. There you go, you're done. Good, good, good. Um, you guys go and speak to them. You guys T pose him. I don't know what you're going to do. I hope you're just sorting itself out. No, you don't seem to be. Person with a knife. Um, we have unit 104. Where is it? Up here. So we'll get 104 gun. And could 107 tend instantly? No, I would have went the other way. Like, <laughs> Just T. T posing like Jesus there. Go and get them boys and girls. Good. Surrendered. That's what we're like. Hmm. That is weird. That one seems to maybe glitched out. Got another shoplifting in progress. Just over the road. Um, good one of five. Could you get 
you engage in foot pursuit over there, right? What other units do we have in the area? We have, like, none. Could one of three. Could you go and speak to them, please? Cheers. Just no available orders. Hmm. Tell you what. Um, close that job. Just tying up officers for no reason whatsoever. Someone's going to that one. Yeah, you. Good, 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 good. Unit 6. Uh, could you go on patrol? Thank you. We've got a suspicious person reported. Don't know what they're suspicious about yet, so let's go and resolve it. I think this is the suspicious person, guys. Can you go and uh, ask the question what he's doing? Well, I don't know what they did with the suspicious person, but that is fine. That car seems to be stuck in a loop. Could you sort this one out, someone? Uh, could you go to that shoplifting if you can find your way via pathfinding? Good. We've got a foot pursuit in progress. Could you join that now, please? Okay, he's just evaded two officers and knocked them down. Thank you. There we go. Good, good, good. <clears throat> injured officers. We've got injured office officer. He's down for six minutes or so. I think we're dealing with things pretty well. All right, could you go on patrol? Thank you. Ugh, it's so hard to breathe. That's why I'm not doing much commentary today. <clears throat> elderly person missing. We have a missing elderly person. 